All right, Tim, thank you. Well, it is a historic day for Canines for Warriors. Nearly a decade since the organization was founded, the campus now has a new name. Leah Shields is on your side with how they're honoring the woman who has helped more than 650 veterans. Camp Canine has helped hundreds of veterans with PTSDs by providing them with a service dog. And now Camp Canine is the Sherry Duval Campus and National Headquarters, named after the woman who started it all. Staff, volunteers, and dogs gathered out front to celebrate the woman they call mom. Our team mission is the Warriors. Simple, pure, nothing else. Sherry Duval knows the power these dogs have to help veterans suffering from PTSD get their lives back. She knows because her son is a veteran who suffered. Ten years ago, she never thought her idea would turn into the nation's largest service dog provider for veterans with PTSD. Each life we save is one less that we're going to read about in the obituaries. Judge Ron Swanson calls her a visionary. She saw this before any of the rest of us did. She saw what we needed to do and could do for those that were damaged in service to, for us. I'm told they didn't even have a sign here before, so now they have this beautiful sign letting people know, welcoming them to Sherry Duval's campus where they have helped hundreds of veterans. In Nocatee, Leah Shields, First Coast News, on your side.